welcome back to our channel design on the dollar I am your host Ida and today so you find yourself in a bond on Valentine's Day or the day before Valentine's Day you just met that new sweetheart and you want to give him or her something um, nice but affordable for Valentine's Day so this is what we are going to do you're going to run out to your local Dollar Tree or your Walmart or your Family Dollar or Dollar General or whatever place has cheap affordable um, mugs and I got mine from Dollar General and it says love with heart and it's an oversized um, mug so they can use it for either storing stuff on their desk, their makeup brushes if it's for that special someone, um, female. Um, they can use it for um, utensils in the kitchen. So this is an oversized one, but if not, Dollar Tree has some nice Valentine's Day mugs as well. And then you're going to find out what their favorite candies are. And you're going to run out and you're going to either get the small sizes or you're going to get the sizes like I did and get assorted um, candies. Assort, assortment of candies. Um, I got nine different kinds of candies. I don't know if all nine of them was going to fit in what we're going to do, but um, we're going to make it happen. Oops, avalanche. Then you're going to get a piece of styrofoam, um, floral styrofoam. Um, and you can get it this size or whatever size will fit down into your cup. As you can see, we're going to have to cut this one down a little bit. But um, So styrofoam. Some ribbon. This is I Love You. Some filler, also from the Dollar Tree. Some tissue paper, Dollar Tree Christmas. Some... Floral picks, Valentine's floral picks. I have several different kinds. These come from um, Michaels, but they were, I think, 50% off. They were a dollar and 29 cent with 50% off or 40% off, whatever, whichever one was their sale at the time. I got some Dollar Tree picks, but we're not going to use the actual picks. You'll see what we're going to use this for. And then I got some more Dollar Tree picks. Um, this is going to be optional, what I'm getting ready to show you now. Um, some Krylons, the looking look spray, uh, spray, and some um, glitter spray. These are optional, as well as um, this is optional. This, is, this is, comes from the Dollar Tree, so this is an option as well to decorate with. You're going to need some scissors. Um, exacto knife and maybe even your wire cutters so those are all the and maybe your glue gun so I have that warming up as well with glue sticks so uh, those are all the supplies you're going to need so gather your supplies and then I'll meet you right back here in just a moment okay the first thing we're going to do is we're going to open up our star phone our full phone and we're going to um, fit it into our uh, cup or whatever you decide to use for this project. It fit in there. Now, what? Uh, what I need to do first is, okay, this is the optional for what I was talking about for the Krylon and the um, looking break spray. Now this was a regular piece of um, tissue paper and I just sprayed it with the glitter um, paint or spray paint. And I don't know if you can see it if it's picking it up on camera, but it's very pretty and shiny. And this is the one that I did with just the looking glass. It just gives it a different look and some texture and feel. So I'm going to position one of my um, things. I'm going to position it with the with the right side out. And this one is going to go right side in. A 
we're going to have something that looks sort of like this. And then we're going to take our styrofoam, take our styrofoam, and we're going to place it down inside of cutting off any extra. So now your styrofoam is down inside your cup. And the next thing we're going to do is we're going to sit this off to the side for a second. And those picks that we got from the Dollar Tree, the seven of the heart roses, we're going to open those up. And we are going to pull the hearts off of the stick. So this has seven so what I'm going to do I'm going to place the, the the side that has the sticky parts on it I'm going to leave that down to the bottom and I'm going to turn this right side up and then what I'm going to do I'm going to take my candies I'm going to choose seven of the ones that I think my sweetie would like and I'm going to glue them on the back of the um candy box okay now we have all seven of our candies on the skewers and <clears throat> this part right here you can put as many candies in here as you want or as less Whatever's gonna, whatever way you can get them in there and it's gonna look right, then you can do it. Now we may can still use these last two without a skewer. So we're gonna just hold them off to the side and we may not be able to get all of these in here. So next thing that we're going to do is we're going to position our candies inside of our container. Okay, now you see this one back here, it's just flopping around. So, what you may have to do is, since it's, the box is so heavy, you may have to take your hot glue gun and glue it to the front of the back of another box. So, we got four of them in. And some M&M's in here. In here. And I'm going to tack it to this corner of this box of the Reese's. So we're going to put all of them in and I'll be right back. Okay, now you have all your candies positioned inside of your cup the way you want it. And then um, around the back, you're going to fluff up the tissue paper so you can't see the styrofoam. And then what we're going to start doing is doing fillers. We're just going to add some final touches to it. We're going to put um, this sweetie will enjoy this as well because um, it's handmade by you and so they'll have something that you did for them as well and if you want to, like right here, take some of your little hearts and you can position it right back here onto the candy box. And like I said, it's not hurting the box, I mean the candies, because 
um, the candies are inside of the box. Okay, so now we have that done and it's almost finished. So we're gonna turn it back around to the front. Be careful because it is heavy. I'm gonna turn it back around to the front. And we still see a little bit of the styrofoam, like right up in here. So we're gonna take on the fillers, a filler, and I'm gonna take a little bit and we're gonna stick it throughout the bouquet. And there you go guys, you have a quick, non-expensive gift that looks like it cost you a whole lot and you made it for less than one, two, three, four, five, that's nine, ten, less than fifteen dollars, around fifteen dollars. And then they have something that you made and it was special for them and um, they will probably not want to eat it, but they will eventually eat it. So don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up. Um, don't forget to subscribe to our channel if you haven't already. Um, hit the little gray notification button so that it will alert you that I uploaded a video. Share this video. Leave me a comment. I love your comments and I try to reply back to all of them. And until next time, I'll see you real soon. Bye.